Uh, R.D. Blair is asking if there's an easy way. This is in the chat room at Category5.tv. Is there an easy way to tell when a web page was updated or created? Uh, there's a cool tool. Uh, if you use Firefox, you can get Firefox add-ons, which can be really, really helpful. One of the ones that I use, now I don't have it installed on my system here because it's just the demo box, um, but it is... Uh, I'm just going to grab it just by doing a quick search in, uh, in Google. It's called Web Developer, and it's a toolbar for Firefox. <clears throat> I'll post a link again. I'll post a link to anything that we bring up on the show uh, in the show notes for episode number 118. This is Web Developer. Uh, addons.mozilla.org slash, oh, I'm not even going to read it. I'll post a link. Mm. Promise you that. Uh, so I'm going to add to Firefox. Nice thing about Firefox add-ons is that you're going to get, you can install this on any platform. You don't have to be on Windows. You don't have to be on Mac. You don't have to be on Linux. I'm on Linux here, and it's installing just fine. So we'll just let that go. It says, of course, now the web developer plugin is, is installed. So now I can restart Firefox in order to activate that. So I'm going to let that go. <coughs> I like this tool. Now, I'm, I am a web developer, so I like having the ability to get further information about the sites that I'm working on. I love being able to outline divs and things like that and get class information from the CSS. That's a really handy feature. So now it looks like that's done installing. It's ready to go. My Firefox has restarted. So now if I look up here, you've got this new uh, toolbar, which you can disable if you, if you don't want it to be there all the time. You can go Toolbars and turn off Web Developer Toolbar. You can go Information, uh, Display. It's going to be one of these. I'll try to guess Display Document Outline. No, that's the outline. Information. Oh, there. View Page Information. That sounds a little more likely. And this tells me lots of info about the site, including when the site was last modified. So that can be very handy if you're working on a website. Sometimes I'll get a, a client that will say, you know, I want my website updated, and they look, I look at that with web developer and realize, oh, it hasn't been updated since 2007. Whew, I'll say. Good time to update. But that's a great tool. And like I was saying, uh, div uh, information is really, really handy. Like if we're looking at a website, say like this, and you're working in CSS, and it's, and it's tough sometimes to tell what you're looking at, you can actually point to an element. Oh, and I pointed to a menu element. Uh, but you can point to an element, and it will highlight it, and it will show you the CSS that is attributed to that element down here. So it's, it, this uh, add-on for Firefox is, is worth a lot more than just finding information about a page. It's really a useful tool for web designers, web developers. Highly recommend it. That's Web Developer. And again, I will post the, uh, the link to that so that you can download and install that add-on add -on in your Firefox uh, directly in the show notes for episode number 118. 